Hi everyone, in this video you will get this system for free. Look at the magic. I click on this simple button, just wait for a few seconds, we are done and you will have a collection of viral Twitter tweets. You can use on Twitter, X, LinkedIn, Facebook, whatever you want. These are not AI generated, these are based on popular viral content. If you are ready, let's get started. Okay friends, so this system will help you solve two problems. Number one, the headache of getting new ideas to post on your social media profiles. And the second, cutting down tons of hours every week, creating content for you. Not any content, not AI generated, but based on real popular content, as you will see right now. A combination of AI, plus automation, plus engaging content. And remember, you can use this for yourself or sell it as a service. So step one, we need a powerful no-code automation tool. And what's better than Make? Recently, I migrated from Zapier to Make and I never looked back. It was a great decision. With Make, I can create any custom automation workflow I want and all that at a fraction of the cost. Make is a great platform, especially the custom apps feature. It was a game changer for me. It allowed me to build my own custom apps, integrate in the systems, and that helped me build complex systems easily that I never thought I can do it without coding. Not only that, I partnered with Make, so now you can join and access the pro features totally for free for one month using the link in the description below. Thank you Make for supporting my audience and supporting my channel and supporting my ad free videos. Okay, now I divided the video into two parts. In the first part, I will show you how to build a simple automation system, like in two minutes to help you understand the idea and how Make works. Then we will move on to the advanced system, give it to you and tell you how it works. Ready? Let's start. Okay, so if you are new to Make, just sign up for free using the link in the description and log in to your account. So, in my case, I have an account, I will log in and simply click here on scenarios and then create a new scenario. So, it tells you to add your first application. Before we go and start building the prototype, first you will need to install my free Make application. It's totally free, just go to the link in the description, enter and click on install. It's that simple. Click on your organization and then install. In my case, it's already installed, so you can see it here, extract web content. This is a game changer you will see right now. So. What I will do simply is add this application and here you have two parameters or two inputs, the URL and the API key. To access this tool for free, just enter Hassan H A S A N 2024. This way you'll get free access to my application. Here you will enter a YouTube video URL. For example, I will go here and open YouTube and let's say I found this clip from this podcast I want to extract a social media post a Twitter tweet from this video I just copy go back here and paste the URL see that's simple okay the power of this custom application it can extract content from any YouTube video or any blog post even so let's run it to test this run and you can see now if you click here in the content, you will see the full YouTube script. Perfect. So now we have the YouTube script. I will connect it with OpenAI. So we can analyze this video and convert it or extract a social media post, like a Twitter tweet from it. So click on create a completion. And then let's select a model like GPT-4 Omni, the latest model. And here select max tokens to zero and then add a message. I will select user. And now simply I will say I will 
provide you with a video script and your task is to analyze and extract the best ideas that can be converted into a Twitter tweet then generate generate a viral engaging tweet based on that then I will pass the video script as an input just say here colon and pass the content so now we pass the content to this application to ChatGPT application or OpenAI so you see now I wrote this simple prompt of course it is not the holy perfect prompt just to make things simple now so what I'm telling ChatGPT or OpenAI to do is to analyze this video script and extract the main points and generate a viral engaging Twitter tweet based on that so we are not generating dummy tweets from AI, we are generating based on content that is engaging. We know it's engaging and it can be viral. So let's test this now. Run again. Now it's generating. Let's wait a little bit and let's see the output. And here is the result. Extracted and here is the generated tweets. You see it with emojis and so on. So this is the basic prototype or the core of our main system. We are going to analyze popular YouTube videos and convert and extract and generate viral tweets based on that. I hope you got the idea. Okay, now you are ready to move to the advanced system. So again, go back to scenarios here and let's save changes, create a new scenario. And now to make things easy for you, I will provide you with the system so you can import directly click on these three dots here input blueprint choose the file and in the description below you can download this blueprint click on save and boom you will have the system ready just download this system it's free no sign ups no emails nothing totally free just download and get it I think I deserve a like for that yeah I think so smash the like button so you will have now the system ready in your account and you can see here this powerful application custom application powering my system so what's going on here look at this what I did is simply I created a simple Google Sheets it has two sheets one for topics and one for tokens let's clear everything here and here you need to enter the topics you want to talk about for example in my case i talk about ai agents and ai trends for example so this google sheet application here is connected and reads topics from this google sheet make sure to enter the spreadsheet id you can get it from here and then paste here and set the sheet name to topics which is the sheet name here you can see sheet name and the range is a colon a which means reads all this column here okay that's it of course you need to connect your google account first so you can click here on add and then sign in with google and that's it so now we have google sheets connected then we are using an iterator so i'm looping over all these topics one by one and then what i'm doing here is calling the youtube api from google and passing each topic as a parameter. So I'm getting the top 10 YouTube videos from search results. And here I'm saying, you can see here the filter. If the view count is more than 100,000, I'm considering that this is a popular video. You can say 50,000, you can say 200,000, it's up to you. So you can change this number if you want. So if the video is popular, getting more than 100,000 views, it will extract the script. And then using OpenAI again, I'm using this prompt to generate the Twitter tweet from the video script. And then what I'm doing is I am saving it into a Google document. So we have a list of tweets in the same Google Doc. And in the second path here, I'm calculating the token count. So you can know how much tokens you use to calculate the pricing if you want. So let me show you this in action again. So I will run the system, click on run, 
you'll see I have an empty Google Doc. This will now be populated with a new tweets. And you will see here the tokens. It will now be populated also. You can see 10,000 tokens. This is the total. And the system is working right now. Let's wait a little bit. Okay, done. Let's open the Google Doc. And you will see now the tweets. Not only the tweets, it will tell you sometimes why it picked them, the analysis. It's really awesome. And here in the Google Sheet, you will find the tokens section or the tokens sheet. You will find the total tokens consumed. 19,000 for GPT-4 Omni, it is like one, $5 for 1 million tokens, so 20,000 tokens, almost nothing. So with this system, you can generate engaging content in minutes. But before you go and start to make this work perfectly for you, listen to these two words. Number one, don't forget to update all the API keys. For example, here we are using Google API. So to get an API a key, you need to go to Google Developer Console and enable the YouTube Data API. You can search here for YouTube Data API and simply click on this API and enable. In my case, it's enabled. Just enable it. It's free. And then simply go here to credentials and create an API key. Just copy it and use it in your system in these three modules why i'm using three simply because i need to get the statistics of each video with this api key and this is to get the channel statistics in case you want to use the channel video view average you can also use this application it's it's optional anyway but i added it in case you want to use it in your system then you need to integrate or connect with your OpenAI account. And don't forget, again, this is not the holy prompt. As we learn the prompt engineering course here on my channel, or if you are following my course on my website, you can always play with this prompt, test different prompts to get better results. Then we have this router, one to calculate the tokens and one to generate or to answer the tweets in the Google Doc here in this Google Documents. Also, you need to create a Google Doc and attach it here. Just select it. Select Document ID and select your ID here. This is the first word. The second word, don't ever, never copy and paste the tweet directly. Yes, the system is super powerful. It's saving a lot of time. But take 5-10 minutes to read at least these tweets check if it fits your account and then you can maybe change a little remove the hashtags remove some emojis whatever you want in the style you want and paste or publish on your profiles and don't forget you can repurpose the same post on facebook on twitter on linkedin and so even you can change the system to generate full blog posts or maybe read blog posts by searching google or maybe creating medium posts this can happen by changing only the prompt or maybe changing the source. Instead of YouTube, we are going to use Google. I explained this in detail in my last automation video. You can check it right here. If you learned something new today, don't forget to smash the like button and see you in the upcoming videos.